As a developer, we always wanted to be productive, be it writing code or using command line shells. Recently, I found out a new shell which acts as a plugin inside an existing shell like terminal inside Mac or in Windows we have Sigwin. This new plugin adds value to our productive time by suggesting us some auto completions. Let's take a look at what is that particular plugin and how we can leverage this to be more productive. Let's get started. Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss any update from Tech Primus. Fish Shell is a command line interface or a plugin which we can apply on an existing terminal like the Mac has an inbuilt terminal, I can apply Fish Shell on the Mac terminal or if let's say I have Windows machines, I can use Sigwin and apply the Fish setup inside the shells category. Similar way if you have Linux, if you have different flavors of Linux, you can download the Fish Shell and leverage Fish Shell to be more productive. Let's look at what do I mean by productivity using Fish Shell. Let me open the terminal for you. So how do I get Fish Shell onto my Mac? So if you're using a Mac and if you're using Homebrew, you can do brew install Fish Shell. And if you notice that, there is something automatically getting suggested and that is what Fish Shell does. Fish Shell helps you in automatically suggesting what you need to type after a particular text, whatever you have entered. For example, the moment I say CLE, it says AR. The moment I say tab, it automatically auto-completes. This applies to any type of commands, irrespective of what we are going to type. If you see that the way I type, if I say M, it says, okay, recently you have been typing minicube. So that is what you require. So the moment I say minicube and if I say STA, it automatically suggests what minicube expects. It could be either start or status or stop. If I do a ST and then say stop, it, it in fact even shows what the command does. So I'm going to say status. So this just shows what is the status of my mini cube, right? Same with any command. So if you, for example, I have been using cube cuttle to get the pod information, service information, see that it automatically suggests what I need to type. As a developer, I feel this is one of the major advantages of fish shell because I don't want to remember any commands. So if you are creating demos for clients and if you're showing demos for people, and if you have a cool shell like fish shell, it's going to help you in being productive and it makes your life easier by suggesting you what you need to type. And it also says what you have done incorrectly as well. And as I said, fish shell is platform agnostic. You can use Mac OS, you can use Linux, you can use the Windows version and also the BSD versions as well. If you're already using the Windows terminal, you can use the sudo app install fish to get it out of the box in the windows 10 and again fish shell is open source the source code for fish shell is present in github.com slash fish shell and that is an organization and under that you can have a fish shell repository see that there are 481 contributors who have contributed to this particular terminal plugin i recently found out that this particular plugin is going to help me a lot and i have installed it today and I'm going to play around with fish shell and you're going to see all my videos with fish shell in it. I hope this particular tool is going to change the way you are going to navigate inside your command prompt or your shell. I hope you found this particular video interesting. As always, if you like the video, go ahead and like it. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe to it. Meet you again in the next video. Thank you very much.